we're still working on our missions to do Marius, so we have to win, I think, like 16 more live arena battles. I think that's where we're at. Let's go ahead and get it in. Definitely banning. <laughs> we're going to have to ban uh, our mons here. Of course, we do the regular Sifi Rotos. We're going to do Georgid and Shuzen. I almost want to get rid of Narcis. He just hits so damn hard. And it's like, if we if we can outspeed our mons, we might have a decent chance. Let's get rid of our mons. Just play it safe. Marius. Okay. So... I do worry that Makage might actually outspeed me, especially now they got rid of Siffy. So the Siffy Rotos combo is out of commission. So um, let's give it to you first. I feel like Narcis is going to be the. Wow, he survived. Oh my god. I'm done. I'm out. We're not doing this. All right, so I had to get rid of their mythical champion, Sigfren. Um, I know he's a damage dealer and he also revives and places block damage, but I, I still don't know enough about him to be comfortable enough. He does have Yumiko in there, so we're kind of um, in trouble there. But at the same time, I don't think Rodos cares too much about getting locked out just because he, he hits that hard and his extra turns uh, pop off quite well. Now, we do have to worry about getting stunned by Odin. So that's going to be an issue. But I think Rodos will be A-OK -okay in that sense. We just have to wait for him to get his um, his A3 back before we can start pounding through everybody. And uh, shit, we got Sun Wukonged. Just back-to-back -back losses here. All right, we're going up against somebody from um, Kenpachi's clan. So he's from FL. His name is even Tinpachi. We'll see what we do here. He's bringing in Sun Wukong. I just remembered that I should probably use a Nithue going up against um, Sun Wukong to prevent him from coming back. So we'll go in with this setup and probably Arbiter or Georgid. I think that might be a good, a good choice here. Bringing in three nukers. I know somebody was like, you should bring in like three supports, I think they said. Three supports and two nukers or, or something like that. Um, I'm kind of wishy-washy. I'm a little inconsistent. I kind of just go with the flow sometimes. Sometimes I'm not even paying attention. But I feel like having another damage dealer might work out quite well. We could also bring in Harima because Harima is pretty good against the Duchess. And Harima also is one of those characters that don't really care about UDK. Oof iffy iffy well Georgia's always a safe bet we're gonna get rid of marius for shirzies and we'll see who he bans hopefully we keep um Siffy in never mind we're fucked because Tormund's gonna screw us unless we just take a chance we take a chance risking it for the biscuit and we got screwed never mind i tried to give it to uh Georgia. tried to give it to him it wasn't happening though Nice, nice, nice. A3. Mm-hmm. A3. A2, never mind. Okay. Shit, son. This is just not my day for Live Arena. Like, constant back-to-back -back losses. Fucking hell, bro. Look at this. Four losses. Four losses so far. All right, we'll band my Neathway. Fifth time's the charm, bro. Fifth time is the charm. We're doing this, gonna do a little bit of this. Gonna give this to Georgid. Then we're gonna hit, I guess we're hitting UDK, I forgot he was there. And hitting that, poke. What is this gonna be, the A3? I forgot what the nuke standard is for Trunda. Yeah, that hits hard. Wukong comes back, put him to sleep. I feel it, I feel it. Oh my gosh, come on. Hit Trunda. Hit Trunda. Revive. Oh, I forgot freaking Tormund was there. Wukong to sleep. Siffy coming in clutch. Finally, after the fifth win, call my mother. Let her know. I meant fifth battle. Did I say fifth win? I meant fifth battle. It was four losses. <laughs> four losses back to back until finally I got a win. I got lucky. 
you know what they say the higher you go the harder it is to actually get any wins so this is probably what it's going to honestly if i don't do my usual cheese strategy this is what it's going to look like because i haven't purposely lost fights to drop in rank to get easier fights i've been i've been actually going at it trying to get some wins in so he's going to bring out the king narcissus combo i should really go out of my way to do armands first i keep forgetting to pick armands first it's one of those things where it's just like i hate armands so much that i don't even want to look at him i don't even want to see him that's how bad it is he's got a blessing for narcissus but he doesn't have um, anything put on that's interesting i don't think i've ever seen that usually when someone has a blessing they put uh, i just realized i don't have a blessing for shuzen so let's get rid of i really feel like udk is going to mess me up here all right so it's a good thing that we did that i was worried that he was going to abandon Ethway and that udk would basically cuck rotos the entire time so i feel like we have a decent chance now we'll see i'm pretty sure we're gonna go first who's in stone skin of course and is gonna be in stone skin then we're gonna have to get rid of okay so i feel like we can one shot armand's relatively easy i wonder about this though okay so we were able to get rid of narcis and now we can get rid of Armand's. We can put Wukong to sleep. Never mind, she takes it. What the heck was that? She took it, her passive, I forgot. It's weird because sometimes it'll apply and then other times it won't. A3? A2, okay. So now we're gonna hit the A1 on Narcis. He counterattacks. Get an extra turn. Oh my gosh. It worked out in my favor. It worked out in my favor. All right, bringing back Shu Zen. Finally, thank you. A second win. And what boots do I need? We're missing Zeal Gloves. So this is like my sixth Liverina chest. And I oh, damn. I, I completely forgot to hit record. Um, My bad. Uh, He got Georgia did. did. Sorry. I completely forgot to hit record there. Taco Taco. <laughs> Bro, look at his... <laughs> look at his name, dude. Yagana looks like a crab. Out of curiosity, I just kind of wanted to see what would happen if I banned Ancora, because Ancora seems to be uh, one of the main issues I have with uh, just doing Live Arena in general. Uh, let me know what you guys think. Is, would you guys ban Narcis over Ancora, or Ancora over Narcis? Because Ancora happens to have like that CC control with her passive, and she also revives, and you know that could be another issue in and of itself. What, what was that? What was that? Okay, I, I, I hit the A2, but then she hit the A1, and I was curious as to why that happened. But then I realized Taurus put the fear in Rodos. So, um, hmm. Everybody's got stone skin on, but we're going to hit the A1, and we're going to see if uh, we can't do something decent to, uh, what do you call it, um, Armand's here. So we're able to put him to sleep. We're able to keep things going. Let's push back turn meter. Never mind, we just placed the uh, weaken on him. She's probably going to place that. Hopefully, we get rid of our mons here. Nice, nice, nice. Looking nice. And can't do anything yet, so we're just going to hit the A1. And we're going to try and remove buffs here. Hopefully, the veil, so now we can hit Narcis. We got lucky there, putting the sleep on him so that he can't take a turn. Taurus is about to take a turn here. That god hand is going to drop, and it's going to hurt. Boom. Very well done. Hitting the A1 or the A3, I mean on Duchess, and then we're gonna have to obviously hit Armand's. We can't let him do his thing here. And we're gonna bring back Arbiter so that she can bring back Harima. Then we're gonna speed boost, increase attack, give it to, let's see, gonna give it to Siffy, who's going to turn meter boost, increase defense, going to have to hit the A1 on Taurus. And the reason we're hitting Taurus is so that his max HP goes down. That way um, his hit isn't that or is less hard he hits less hard because his damage is based on H hp so we're gonna put narcis to sleep we're going to remove buffs some buffs only on only on uh, narcis here he's going to hit the a2 on somebody it's going to be siffy then we hit the a3 on taurus we're going to rip into narcis who was another max hp um or um, hp based champion and we hit the a2 there so I like the name there. That was a really good one. All right, so we got a Tuppy here. He's got two Mythicals and Armands. I brought in Wukong because I figured it might be a great way to deal with Galath here. But we also have UDK here. 
it's it's an issue altogether and of course he gets rid of wukong so we'll see how we do with just georgian if we're able to even hit hard enough the issue here is that galathir is not going to be easy to take down right away even with multi-hitters coming from from um what do you call it georgian so we'll see and everybody's in stone skin of course we're gonna give this to georgian and let's go rip through our mons and jesus i, I don't even know Let's just hit the A2. Yep. Uh, hmm. Well, I mean, if we transform... No, you know what? Let's just, hit, let's just do this. Let's just hit Marius. Take care of the damage dealers. Or do our best to. I don't know. I feel like this is just the battle where I'm going to be outclassed. I think in this form, he can actually be, be um, killed with one shot. So we'll see. That's not if... I mean, if, if Marius, Marius takes that move then we're kind of SOL. Never mind. I think this is his damage. Yeah, look at those buffs, dude. Yeah, he's about to smash. Oof. Oof, oof, oof. We're out. That was an L. All right. So we're going up against this other mythical champion. And... Xena. Xena actually hits pretty hard. Now I'm worried that we're going to get frozen out if I keep Torment in, so we're just going to go ahead and get rid of him. I am worried about this champion here. In fact, I'm worried about both of them because Nice hits hard. He counterattacks. I can't get, I'm, not, I'm not getting any block debuffs on him. Xena actually hits pretty damn hard too because of that passive that she has. She was able to cut in, so I think she was meant to be made to cut into. Oh my god, what the... F ah... I wanted to keep this guy in just to see if I could learn how to fight him, but it doesn't look like that's going to be the case. In fact, uh, we're just going to leave. I'm not going to waste anybody's time here. 